Good morning, everyone. Today I'm starting a work week in my life. Today is my first week of my first job ever post-grad. I'm so excited. I am a marketing coordinator at a marketing agency and I'm so excited to start today. Pretty sure I'm doing like training and stuff. I woke up at seven because I wanted to be able to like take my time this morning. I knew I was gonna be filming this, but I just wanted to like also not be in a rush, but I just made some coffee and I'm about to make some breakfast. I'm officially ready. I finished my makeup and my hair. It is 8.16, so I need to leave, so I'm about to go down. So this agency actually has two offices, and I have to go to the one that's further away because I think that's where HR is. But I'm about to go, and I'll update you guys when I get back. I'm back in my apartment. It is not even five yet. I got to leave early, so thankful for that. But I am going to be mostly remote right now for this job, unless told otherwise. I got my company laptop, so official, we love that. Today was mostly just getting my accounts in order, logging into a bunch of different things, um, setting up meetings for the week. I have lots of meetings coming up, but I'm glad I do get to work from home. Unfortunately, I do not have a desk, so that's where my desk is supposed to go, but you know, I don't have one yet. But I do have like this little area to work and then I also have this. So I'm gonna call my mom, catch her up on the day and then I'm gonna fill out my work planner that I recently got from Target. It's so cute and like all the colors are so fun and happy um, because I have like three meetings tomorrow. So um, I'm gonna write those down and just write other meetings that I have for the week down and just get a little bit more organized and yeah. Currently heating up my leftovers last night from dinner. I just finished writing everything in my planner and like set out my little workspace for tomorrow since I don't have a desk. And I also lit a candle there and over there to get some nice smells in here. That sounded weird, but I'm about to edit a video I actually filmed yesterday. It was like a little Sunday vlog just for fun. And then, oh, my food is ready. Hopefully get that video uploaded for tomorrow. It around quick little taste test very good big fan all right it's eight o'clock now my first meeting is at 8 15 so i'm gonna go ahead and log into everything make sure everything is set up i just threw on the sweater because i ended up being a little bit cold but i had my meeting with the sales team this morning and it was really embarrassing because i couldn't hear them like something was wrong with my like speakers but they introduced me in the beginning of the meeting being a new member of the marketing team and I like couldn't hear them so I was just like waving but then I ended up having another meeting I didn't even know about and I have to do some upcoming research and then I had a meeting right after that with some more people and that one wasn't really doing anything but now I'm about to have training with my manager but during the last meeting my power went out for like 20 minutes so I was like on my personal hotspot so that was not fun but I'm about to do some training and then after that I'm gonna go to lunch but those are the updates so far. Hopefully my power doesn't go out again because there is a power outage on the street I live on. So love that for me. It is 12 o'clock now. I am very hungry. I did not eat breakfast this morning. I just like was not hungry and was not in the mood for anything. So um, I'm gonna make some lunch real quick. I've already had three meetings today and I just got finished with training. And then the rest of this afternoon, I'm actually not doing too much. Um, my manager is gonna tell me some tasks to do through the training that we did. And then I'm also going to start on my research and then also training on this software that we use. So, super fun.
Here is my lunch. It's a salad drenched with honey mustard dressing. It's just romaine lettuce with shredded carrot and onion, some tomato, chicken, and cucumber. And then I have a little bit of my pasta left over from Sunday night that I'm gonna finish off. Second coffee of the day. Just got in the car and I decided that I'm going to go to Ikea and pick up the coffee table that I have wanted, but it's been out of stock and they have like eight left. And they had 16 left yesterday, so I feel like it's a very popular one. It's been a little bit later now. I just got back from Ikea and I also stopped by Home Goods and TJ Maxx and I had a package come, but I'm kind of mad because look how terrible like this is how it came it was literally already open really glad no one stole these but i got these white dried bunny tails i want to get like a black vase to put this in and put it over there um that's why i originally went to home goods because i was looking for a vase but i didn't see one i just got a few things from home goods and only one thing from tj maxx and it's mostly like kitchen related first thing i got is this paper towel holder it literally doesn't have like a stopper but I literally have been looking for a black paper towel holder. And I got some tongs and then this like big spatula that's like not flimsy like my other one because I think I want to make quesadillas tonight. So I thought these would go well. Whenever I like flip my quesadillas, I like use tongs and then I use like a spatula like this. I don't know if that's just me, but that's how I do it. And then this is the last thing I got from Home Goods. I got it mainly because it's pink, but it's just a little um, scrubber. And then you can put like dish detergent in here. And then it has like an extra head to switch it out. But I'm actually going to put this in the shower and like leave it in there. So after I shower, I can like scrub the tiles. I saw that on a TikTok and I'm gonna put like cleaner in here. So it just like squirts out. So it'll be like cute and pink in my shower. The last thing I got was from TJ Maxx and it's this giant liquid measuring cup. It literally holds four cups of whatever, but I thought it was worth it for $5. I mean, normally like two cups or one cup is like $5 if it's like glass. So I thought it was a pretty good deal. Here's my lovely dinner. I kind of burnt this quesadilla. Um, it's just ground turkey. I have lots of leftovers, so I'll probably have this again with cheese, tomato, and sour cream. great job that's why i do a great job here is the almost end result i'm so happy with it i'll insert the name of it on the screen but this is from ikea it was like 80 bucks they're nesting tables so you can actually move this smaller table and make it like a side table and just have this is the coffee table but you can make it bigger or smaller so i really liked that i didn't know that that base that goes right here was dark brown i thought it was black so i'm actually going to take this piece to Lowe's and get them to measure a piece of glass so like everything is cohesive. I also need to get some goo gone because the sticky residue it took me about 20 minutes to build. Um, this is the first thing I've ever built with myself. It was really easy. This is the only tool I have, this mini screwdriver. So it probably would have taken me a little bit less time because this was kind of hard to use. But other than that, not too shabby. I'm very proud of myself for building that. I'm about to take a shower and then I'm gonna go to bed and start editing this video. Eating my breakfast and drinking coffee in bed this morning because I was just too comfy and I didn't want to sit on my very uncomfortable chair. I know you're like not supposed to work in your bed, but here we are. I don't have to be online until 10. Not that I'm like not working, like I work 8 to 5, but I don't have to show my face until 10. I guess I should say that and then I'll get out of my bed. For now, we're in the bed. I told myself last night that I was going to work out during my lunch break and then eat, but I'm too hungry to do that. I'm making lunch right now. I'm gonna make some quesadillas. I had this for dinner last night and I have lots of leftovers, so that just sounded good. I'm 
finally getting rid of my huge cardboard collection. I just changed into some workout clothes because I'm going to work out after I go to Lowe's. So I'm gonna go to Lowe's and take this piece, like I said last night, to go get it measured and get glass cut to go underneath there because there is nothing there. I'm gonna do that and I also need to get lights for all those lights and this light also needs a light but I don't know how to like unscrew that thing, so I'm going to wait. My friend Natalie is going to South Carolina with her boyfriend this weekend, but they're gonna stop here and stay here tonight because it's a nine hour drive and it's only four hours to come to Atlanta, so that kind of like breaks it up halfway, but they'll be here probably around nine tonight, so we're not gonna do anything, obviously. Just got back from Lowe's, which was a total fail. Um, their glass cutter was not working, but I bought some light bulbs, like I was saying, because I need them for those lights right there, and I bought the wrong kind. They literally won't twist in. I'll be going to the other Lowe's tomorrow to return those light bulbs and get the right ones and hopefully get my glass cut for the coffee table. I got Chick-fil-A for dinner because it was right beside Lowe's and it just smelled really good, and I was kind of waiting for like traffic to die down, so I was like, you know what, we'll do it. We can do curbside. Oh, my mom is now calling me because she didn't answer. She ignored me. So um, I'm going to talk to her and eat my Chick-fil-A. I went ahead and put my dried bunny tail in this little clear vase, and I think it looks really cute. I want to get a black face. They're definitely smaller than I thought they were going to be, but I think they're still cute. Wow, I literally look so bad. My eyes hurt so bad from staring at the computer screen literally all day. But I thought today wasn't going to be so busy, but this ended up being the busiest day. I'm literally so tired and my body hurts because I'm tired of sitting over there on those acrylic chairs. They are not comfy. I really wanted to work out again today, but that is not happening. And I also wanted to edit this video but that is most likely not happening either, but hopefully I can do that tomorrow. I'm very excited for this weekend. Auburn is playing Kentucky at home. I'm obviously like not going to the game, but I have two friends coming to visit me and we're gonna watch the game together and I'm really excited. And I think we're gonna go to brunch on Saturday. So it'll be really fun. Here is the glass I got cut from Lowe's. It costs like $15. Just clean the table so it's nice and clean. I don't think you're gonna be able to see on camera. You kinda can, it's kind of smudged right here. I cannot get the adhesive off, which is really annoying. I also like scratched the glass. You definitely cannot see on camera. And it's not noticeable, really. It's like literally a hairline scratch, but I'm just mad at myself because that was my fault. It looks exactly the same, but the glass is there. It's so clean. Um, as you can see, there's little holes right there for nails to go in. So on the top, they have these little tabs. They just don't have holes in them. But if you can see that little circle right there, that's like a little glass cushion thing. And I actually ordered some off Amazon. So I'll be able to put those down there so the glass can be supported and it won't be all shaky. You guys are currently sitting on my faucet in my bathroom. I just wanted to show my little outfit. This top is from Fabletics. It has a cute little tie. 
And these black shorts are from TJ Maxx. I love them. Also, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I got a scale and I'm so excited about it. It was on sale on Amazon. I'll link it down below. I really like that scale because it has a Bluetooth feature and you can see like your water weight and your body fat percentage and like all this other stuff. Now that I'm working a full-time job, I'm trying to like figure out and establish my workout routine, but I'm about to go upstairs to the gym at my apartment and run on the treadmill, I think. Maybe do a few weights. It's been a hot minute since I used weights and also like ran on a treadmill. I'll probably just walk on like an incline. Maybe do some sprints, I don't know. So this is my new home screen. I'm so obsessed with the first page, it's so cute. I only made five of my icons shortcuts because I don't like how it like does that and I can be a little impatient. Then we have the second page. I love having this little widget of the date in the corner but this page just basically has Google Maps, um, the Find app, Uber Lyft, um, weather calculator, um, banking stuff, and like all my social media and email. Then I have my third and final page at the top up there. I have some fitness apps, and then on this side, I have Slack, which I use for work, and my work email. And then this is like all shopping apps minus the pattern, which I really love that app. And then I have a picture of my boyfriend, Blake, and then my battery life on my phone and my apple watch then i have all the rest of my apps that are on my home screen just in the app library which i love this update so much and you can search at the top i obviously just took a shower but i wanted to end the video here let me know if you want to see more videos like this thank you so much for watching be sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys soon bye